Given his background, Woody is one of these people that's very interested in his return for investment. And the question is, what, what am I investing and what am I getting in return? But when you stop to think that WCS and its projects worldwide in more than 60 countries are probably conserving at this point close to 40% of the world's biological diversity for an investment of less than $100 million a year, that's a good return on investment. And that's exactly the kind of discipline and question that someone like Woody brings to us. There is this wonderful combination of being able to save these magical critters, but do it with such a value proposition that anybody uh, who has been in business or is interested in, in uh, value systems can realize that this is one hell of a bargain. Ward Woods has been one of the most transformative leaders for the Wildlife Conservation Society. He has served as our chairman for the last six years. He has been extremely generous through his own philanthropy, and he's also brought some new ideas and new people to help inform our decisions and support our work and conservation work around the world. So he has been a fundamental leader, a partner in the work that we do, and a dear friend to WCS. We're not going to be able to fence off the wilderness. It's going to be part of the human community, and we have to be able to get the support of the public and of decision makers to continue to allow these critters to survive. He will go to the field, he'll meet with our people, he'll meet with our partners, and really help us understand what are the issues, what is the impact that we're making, and how can we make a bigger impact. And uh, that's something great, when you have a chair of your board that's engaged, that's giving you good ideas, and that's personally committing through his own philanthropy to make a difference on the ground. And that's what someone like Ward Woods is.